So this is part three of the four-part series uh, that I've been doing on productivity. It's under the, the, the heading and perspective of running scared is running fast. Recent um, economic studies have shown that people are far more motivated by the fear of loss than they are the uh, prospect of gain. It's, it's called the concept of loss aversion. And when I first read about that, it, it, it struck me a little, a little off because my, uh, my whole point of view, I thought, was about, about being very goal-oriented, um, uh, the power of positive thinking and all those kinds of things. Um, and I, that's certainly an aspect of, of what's allowed us to be successful over the years. But as I started to reflect more on, on that, that point of view about loss aversion, it started to look more and more familiar to me than I, than I originally thought. And I began to think back on the times that we've been most productive, made the most gains in, in our business and our careers. And oftentimes it was driven by, by a fear of failure um, as a pretty strong motivator to, to move out of old modes of doing things and get over humps of uh, of being flat, those times you get where you just can't get anything done. And I realized what was going through my head were thoughts like, if I don't figure out some way to solve this client problem, I'm gonna get fired. So I gotta really buckle down and figure this thing out. Or if I don't really ramp up my business development efforts, because we're gonna run out of client projects and the business gonna shut down. Those kinds of extreme points of view were actually very, very motivating. So when I started to think about it, We've embraced that concept of, of the fear of failure as a, a productive driving force actually for a very long time. And my advice to you is, is to do the same. Don't look at it as a negative. I used to think that when I had those thoughts, that was an unhealthy part of my psyche. It's actually not. It's a very natural way for human beings to think. So my point of view now is embrace those natural motivators. And part of those natural motivators is a fear of failure and really buckle down and, and drive your way, plan your way past those points of fear. And then when you reach those milestones as you overcome those fears, then fully embrace the exhilaration of having stared that beast down and, and won. Uh, and there's a tremendous amount of positive energy that comes from conquering those, those fears. But use them to your advantage. Fear actually can be your friend. So our intention for you again is that you continue to consult from strength. Thank you. Thank you.